Hello ferrets, um, this is Stephanie from Ferret World and today is a beautiful day in Sydney, Australia um, and a lot of you probably know that it's starting to warm up quite a bit and so I would, I thought that I might give you a few tips on how you can adjust your ferrets to the heat. Now some of you think, um, well not think, but some of you might think that um, the best thing to do once it starts to get warm is to automatically switch the air conditioning on or start putting ice cubes in their cage or any kind of other cooling methods. However, that's not always necessarily true, necessarily true, because you actually want to adjust them to the heat. So the best way to do that is to kind of let them suffer through it a little bit, as long as it's not too hot. You don't want them to die, obviously, but you want them to be able to shed their winter coat. And the most natural way of doing that is for them to adjust to the heat as it starts to get warmer every day. So do not start to stress or panic immediately once it starts to heat up. Um, just kind of let them go through the motions a little bit. Once it starts to get really scorching hot, um, they, would, they would have been adjusted enough uh, to be able to handle it a lot better. Once it starts to get really hot, then I'd probably recommend having the air conditioning on or a fan or putting them in a cooler room. But at this stage, if it's just nice, nice warm weather, even though they look fairly hot, as you can see Bear is starting to look a bit lethargic and the others are still lying around, just make sure that they have plenty of water to drink and just let them shed that winter coat because that'll really help them out once it starts to heat up and we all know how hot it gets in Australia when it's really hot it's not good and they don't want to have their winter coat uh, and not be adjusted to the heat at that stage so that's my best advice and I am not naked I do have a dress on just wanted to point that out okay bye bye